Travis County deputies arrested six people this morning after they chained themselves together and blocked the doors at the downtown jail. They were protesting the deportation of undocumented immigrants. A group is in front of the jail, which is where we find KXAN's Sophia Beausoleil live with the latest. What's going on there, Sophia? Hi, good afternoon to you, Brian. Well, you can take a look and see that the protesters are still outside of the jail. They're actually waiting for the six people that are with them to be released. But take a look at this video. You can see that the six protesters locked with one another, sitting in front of the Travis County Jail garage door in an effort to block immigrants from being deported. Now, about 10 minutes after that, deputies arrested them. The Austin Immigrant Rights Coalition says it's doing this because it's against secure communities, or SCOM, and that's when people are arrested after, or rather, their fingerprints go through a criminal and immigration database if they are arrested. And the program is through the U.S. Immigration and Customs Enforcement, or ICE, which says, quote, it prioritizes the removal of criminal aliens, those who pose a threat to the public safety, and repeat immigration immigration violators. Now, the protesters believe non-criminal undocumented immigrants in Travis County are being targeted. And if we don't stand up for people that every day wake up to be hardworking, then who are we as people? That's what I want people to know. This is, this is ridiculous. And the group says 19 people are deported a week. It says it's met with the sheriff's office last week and has not heard what they want to hear, and which is to stop this program for the time being. Now, we're going to hear from the Travis County Sheriff's Office later on today. Uh, we'll have that for you at 5 and 6. But again, the group says it'll be here until they get what they want, also until people from their groups is released. Reporting live from downtown Austin, Sophia Beausoleil, KXAN News. Okay.